everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm filming a summer evening routine. I filmed this on Friday after work, so this was my Friday evening. This routine is when I'm trying to be a little bit more productive. I was working from home this day and on Fridays I like to just make sure I've got everything checked off my list, make sure I tidy up my desk to be ready for the weekend. I just like to tidy up my space a bit, just make my room feel all fresh, make sure my laptop and everything is put away just so I'm all prepped for the weekend and don't feel like I've got anything from work that's going to be sort of distracting me on the weekends. Just using my Zoflora to give everything a wipe down, make sure everything's nice and clean. I find having a nice clean room ready for the weekend always makes me feel so refreshed and yeah, just to have a nice relaxing weekend so I don't have to worry about it on Saturday or Sunday. Like I said, I always like to make sure my laptop and anything to do with work is put away on the weekends just to make sure everything's tidy and then I'm not focusing on that and just having a really nice break from work over the weekends. just to get some stuff for my tea. I was making a pasta this evening so I was just getting ready to go to the supermarket. started unpacking all of my um, bits that I got for my dinner. I then started to get um, ready and start unwinding for the evening. I don't know if anyone else is the same but as soon as I finish work I just want to get my makeup straight off. I want to get them ready, get my comfy clothes, so I'm just starting to take my makeup off with the Primark Micellar Water. I actually really like this Primark Micellar Water. I've got really sensitive skin and it doesn't react to my skin at all. The only one I used before this was the Garnier one and I think they're pretty similar. day that day so I use my hair syrups my favorite ones are the Rapunzel and mint condition I usually put these in before I wash my hair I find it really helps with hair growth and just making my hair super shiny <music> after 
to buy but put in the oil I just make sure to massage it in really well this is meant to stimulate hair growth and it just works the product into my hair really nicely and then just popping my hair up into a claw clip to leave the oils to just soak into my hair before I wash it shower I used my Olaplex shampoo and conditioner. I also used my Primark vanilla and brown sugar body exfoliator and my Imperial Leathers mango and papaya body wash. It smells so nice. When I got out of the shower I used my Red Ken Extreme Anti Snap and my Beauty Works heat protectant as well as my LV the No Haircut Cream. I like to do this as soon as I get out of the shower as I find it helps make my hair so much less knotty. I then use my Tangle Teaser Wet Brush. It's meant to prevent breakage when you're brushing wet hair. I then used my absolute favourite body moisturiser which is the Sol de Janeiro Bum Bum Cream and also my Soap and Glory Hill Balm. If you have never smelt this body cream please go and try it, it is literally the nicest for the summer. cozy PJs. I've got some silk ones. These are from Topshop and I absolutely love them. Of course had to finish off the Sol de Janeiro scents with the body spray. This smells exactly the same as the body moisturiser and it's so nice. For my skincare I went in with my Comfort Zone Renight Cream. This is so nice if your skin's dry, especially if you were sunbathing in the day or anything. Um, it just moisturises your skin so much. I then went in with one of my new favourites which is the Primark Vitamin C Eye Cream. It smells like oranges and it just makes my eyes feel so much like cooler and more awake. I think everyone knows by now that this is my absolutely favourite lip balm. It is the Elizabeth Arden 8 Hour Lip Mask. It's literally worth every penny. I'm starting to run out a little bit but I would definitely be repurchasing. Then using my Rapid Lash on my lashes, of course you need to take care of them. I find this makes the biggest difference and I would recommend to anyone. I then just go in with a little bit of oil on my eyebrows because I use the got to be glued. I feel like I need to definitely be taking care of them. I have to put in hair gel on them every day after a long week. So yeah, I just run a little bit of this through with a spoolie. Then just finishing off the skincare with my Mario Badescu Rose Water Spray. My dog was so tired, it was so cute, he was actually falling asleep as I was stroking him. For tea this evening I decided to make a king prawn spaghetti, it was so nice. So I just started by chopping up one red onion. just added in some olive oil into a pan and let that heat up and then once it was hot I added in my red onion. I then added in some easy garlic because I'm lazy and I do not want to chop any up. I then just let both of those fry off and gave it a little mix. I then added in some of my favourite prawns, they're from Aldi, they're the garlic and herb prawns, they're frozen and I just added those in. I was then just seasoning my prawns with some chilli flakes, paprika and salt and pepper. 
Once the prawns were almost finished cooking, I added in about half a pot of single cream. I then added in some sweet pepper pasta sauce. Once that cooked down a bit, I added a squeeze of lime and then added in lots of parmesan. Once the spaghetti was cooked, I just added that in with some pasta water as I was adding that. I then just served up the pasta and added some extra parmesan on top, but this pasta was unreal. Definitely try it. It was so nice. My hair was about 80% dry at this point, so I just used my Revlon Hot Styling Brush just to dry it through. If you're like me and absolutely hate drying your hair, this is the best invention. I feel like it's so much easier than drying your hair and I get less bored doing it. I'm thinking of doing a full tutorial with my Revlon brush, so if you guys would like to see that, please let me know down in the comments below. just added some of my Olaplex bonding oil. This smells incredible, it's one of my favourite oils. I then just chilled for the rest of the evening watching some TV. I find something that's really been helping me is these two books. Um, the first one is Good Vibes, Good Life by Vex King. This is a book basically about sort of like positive mental attitude, manifestation. The next book is a manifesting journal. I got this one from Amazon and I absolutely love it. I was trying to show you guys a few pages of um, stuff that was in there. But if you're into manifesting, I would definitely get this book. I love it and use it all the time. This is my favourite lamp. It's from Oliver Bonus. It's so cute. It's got a little like half crescent in there. That was the end of my evening routine. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll speak to you in my next video.